A bluegrass legend retired from touring tonight at an iconic Nashville music venue. Doyle Lawson tells our News Channel 5 Cena Sleem why the Station Inn was the perfect place to say goodbye. A sold out show. I love his gospel repertoire. He does such a good job at, at, at the gospel and the Help is on the Way album is one of my favorites uh, for sure. In front of hundreds of loyal fans. We drove a couple hours just to come here just for this and I'm thrilled to be able to catch him before the end of 2021. And old friends. One of the biggest honors uh, that I can think of to have Doyle and his band here. Uh, and I know JT, would. this is the way he would want it. After nearly six decades on the road, Doyle Lawson is ready for some rest. Come to the station in one more time. The Bluegrass Music Hall of Famer says it only made sense to celebrate his last day of touring at the station in. It's the environment, the atmosphere, the whole place. It's the feel, feeling of people. A venue he calls synonymous to bluegrass music. Started playing. Uh, shows at the station in very early on though and uh, down through the years I can't tell you the, the many times I've played and I've got great memories uh, of the people being here. Doyle Lawson and Quicksilver have been nominated for seven Grammy Awards. The 77 year old says there have been so many memorable moments with his band by his side. I never thought as a, as a kid growing up over in East Tennessee that I would get to see the world as I have and get to visit all 50 of these beautiful United States. But for now, it's time to say goodbye to his days on the road. After all, this rest has been well-deserved. Cena Sleem, News Channel 5. Lawson says he's not retiring from the industry altogether. He will continue to produce other acts.